Hello friends and welcome back. Today we'll be learning about a new function that is the average function. Average function basically utilizes all the values you give it and it creates an average value of it. We'll be applying average for time. So our use case is that we have an employee sheet where everyone is coming in at a certain time and we want to uh, calculate the average time and for that particular employee so this is how our sheet is going to look like I've created a sample sheet for the entire month and uh, let's go over to our sheet and see how it's going to work out so before I start work all of these uh, columns I uh, have uh, a certain value let me also do this okay they have a certain value where the employee is checking in on daily basis and it is calculating uh, it and displaying it in time format so uh, just to give you an idea the format for this for these cells is, uh, is set to custom and the time format is hours and minutes minutes so I will apply the same over here before applying the formula I will just set the make sure that I have the exact same format set for this column so that once I calculate the average it it portrays the time in the same format that I am recording it so let's calculate it for Alan so I'll uh, press the equals to sign and start writing average so it gives me a lot of uh, uh, functions so you can see the brief description it returns the average of its arguments which can be numbers names or anything so I'm going to apply it on this um, on this uh, range so this range is basically I'm since I'm calculating it and uh, applying it for Alan so I'll pick up Alan's complete month that starts from column number E4 all the way up to A84 and I'll close the brackets and it will give me an average time so Mr. Allen is coming in on an average time of 9:19 a.m. so if I want to apply it to the all the rest of them I'll just click on this small little crosshair over here and drag it down to the rest and there you have it folks just in a minute time you have calculated an average for each of these employees which you can utilize as per your need this was a quick little video for using average function you can apply average uh, function to other numeric values as well which we will cover in future sometime but for today, this was the video. I hope you liked it and please keep subscribed to the channel so you keep learning new things every now and then. Please do take care of yourselves and Allah Hafiz.